So another titration reaction, this is closer to uh, the type of problem that's in the homework. So sulfuric acid with uh, sodium hydroxide, sulfuric acid being a uh, strong acid for the first hydrogen and a weak acid for the second hydrogen. So we have uh, 12.5 mLs, 0.5 molarity. Multiply the molarity by the volume in liters, we get moles, 0 0.0065 moles. And since the first hydrogen is strong, we're going to get that for our moles of the hydronium ion and the same number for the moles of our hydrogen sulfate. We have 10 mLs of 0.65 molarity sodium hydroxide. Molarity times liters gives us 0 0.0065 moles of sodium hydroxide. So we're doing our first neutralization between the hydroxide and the hydronium ion that we have. Uh, so we write out our neutralization equation. Uh, we see that our uh, smaller number right here is the hydrogen ion. So that gets consumed totally and we're left with a little bit excess of hydroxide. That means this excess hydroxide is gonna to start to neutralize the hydrogen on the hydrogen sulfate. So that's our second neutralization reaction. Our excess hydroxide comes down here. So I have our 0 0.0065 moles of the hydrogen sulfate. The hydroxide now is a limiting reaction goes to zero. We're left with 0 0.006 moles of the hydrogen sulfate and 0 0.0025 moles of sulfate. So we have a weak acid and its conjugate base. So we can use our uh, henderson hasselbach equation for that. The Ka for hydrogen sulfate is 1.2 times 10 minus 2. Negative base 10 log is a pKa of 1.92. So we stick in the values that we have. Again, we can use moles in this ratio of base over acid. So 1.92 for a Ka, a log of the base, the sulfate, over the acid, the hydrogen sulfate. We end up with 1.92 minus 1.38. We end up with a pH of 0.54. So uh, this is closer um, to um, the type of homework problem that uh, we have than the last video I had provided.